Hey, I'm Charting Man Dan. If you like this video, I encourage you to check out our website, thechartguys.com, home of technical analysis, learning, and education, where we broadcast live market coverage every morning, provide live chart consultation, and point out key levels on your favorite plays in our community chat room. Why not check out our free trial and join the best technical analysis community online? Looking at WTW here on the daily, weekly, and five-minute time frames, we can see a very bullish Friday gap up and close just under the upper Bollinger Band resistance. I don't know what the news is to be honest and I don't care. I'm a day trader mostly and I look at the five minute charts to give me all the indication of a stock's action that I need. If you are investing or trading in longer term plays, it's definitely important to keep up with the news to see the way that earnings are going or things like that. But as a day trader, that's not important. News leads to emotion and using charts we want to cut out all emotion. So a little game I like to play is making up news. So let's say that Santa Claus is endorsing Weight Watchers. We have a big gap up and we have support now $20 psychological level. That was the low of the day. If we break that level, we'll look to come down and potentially fill this gap to 1749. But as of right now, full steam ahead for the bulls. 10 day moving average is 1692 support. RSI is very high at 83.68, so that indicates we could see a pullback in the near term future. We'll be watching how the price reacts to that upper Bollinger Band resistance now that we were rejected on Friday. So an indication to this breakout to come, we had the big gap up on the Oprah news. I certainly heard about that news. Consolidated, and here we are in the consolidation period. We found a high of 17.25, came down, found a higher low off of the initial pullback. And then we saw a higher high the day before the breakout, so 1749. And then we closed higher than any point during this consolidation period. So that was a, a signal for the bulls that something was happening. We had some loading, increased volume, and then the big volume spike on that gap up. So on the weekly chart, we had a big major close over the 100 week moving average resistance. That is now support at 1771. The, up, the RSI is at 82 and overbought in that regard as well. So we'll see where we are going to find resistance and pull back from. We can see looking at previous price, we had a high in the last week of 2014 of 2680. So that will be a resistance level we're watching if we do continue heading higher. But again, that upper Bollinger Band on the daily chart is going to be the key level to watch. So looking at the five minute chart now, this is what we utilize at thechartguys.com on live webcam every day, every morning at 9.15 and again for the close. And we can see the bullish action that unfolded. We held that 20 period moving average the majority of the morning into the afternoon, tested it first thing and with that support test and hold, it gave the bulls the confidence and we ran up the majority of the day, like I said. So then we found resistance 23.55, stalled out a little bit. You can see multiple attempts to break that high. And then we pulled back, lost 20 period moving average support. And then we were in a little bit of a downtrend consolidation for the rest of the day. So the strength of this trend, you can see we didn't even test the 100 period moving average support. And that is a whole lot information, so a whole lot more information on this five minute chart compared to the daily chart I just told you. That daily chart can give you the general trend, the history, the high, low, open, close, but zooming into the five minute charts like we do live on webcam every day, we can see a whole lot more information and that is definitely utilized when day trading or determining prime entries and exits. So come check out thechartguys.com for a free week. I guarantee that you will learn something and potentially enjoy the service enough to stick around. I hope so and I look forward to meeting you in the chat room. Thanks for watching this video and have a great weekend.